Um, you know, I will say I feel great because Black Empowerment, you know, we are the first black coach, um, the first coach um, for Women at Sunset to bring back a, a medal for me. It was a great achievement and I felt blessed or I, I still feel blessed, you know, to, to go back home and then everybody will be like, yo, this is the first coach that gave us a, fin a podium finish. So for me, I feel blessed and it's a great honor. Um, I think we would, um, first of all, during the, the first leg, uh, my players, I think we were not training as much as we were supposed to. Um, we were not getting used to um, each other as we were supposed to get used to each other, like um, as a team. So for me, now, I will say, um, we will, after we got that break, and then I had to sit them down, I had to work with them mentally because I will notice we the first leg mentally we were not focused, we were not fit enough as a team. So during that break, and then I had to call them for a training camp, and then we had to sit down and we had to work with them mentally because, um, skills wise, fitness wise, they were good, they were super, but when it comes to mentally fitness, they were not. So we worked more around that. And when we got to Sun City, then it showed the booty they were mentally fit because they worked more of as a team. And they were pulling each other when one was down, then one was helping the other one to, to get up. So we worked more of a family, worked more of a team. So I think Neo in the lesson the booty is seven delega full as a Sanchez team. The last few minutes of the game, I could see that um, this entire man we got here was like in the defense. So to introduce the woman on because she's a defender, but to introduce her, um, who, who, who sent her for me, it was like you go there, you defend every ball that you get, you make sure that you capitalize on that one, and then you see it. So for me, now, that was like the instruction from her saying, I need you to go and defend all the balls that are going for people about to yeah. it's our ball. Okay. So, so she got on, on court and then she did exactly as I said. And then I said to the team, please support her because you know she's not a center. Mm -hmm. So whenever she has the ball, don't run away, but instead go towards her so that she will know where to feed and how to feed because don't put pressure on her as she's not she's playing a different position. They must just expect people like you know I, I'm so happy with this year we have young players from Bar City we have old players that have been with the, the team Pumalanga Santé. And another thing, we, we, we bring back some of the talented and um, most experienced players. So for me, I will say, they must just expect a wow performance from Santé. And also, our goal this year um, is not gold, but it's, it's a Natini. It's not gold, but it's a relegation match. I will say, first of all, thank you so much for not um, giving up on us. You know, uh, like you said, first leg last year, we dropped, like everybody lost in hope we are because we were losing left, right and center. And uh, so, Mara, the, the, the fans are bazang about Pele and Temba, but they were there, always with us, encouraging us. So I just want to say thank you so much for Muguti Banga and Pele and Temba. And um, for us, this year, coming in this year, we promised nothing but the best from Mpumalanga. Like, we are here to win, to get it. We know what we finished with the arm last year, but this year we want even more better and better results. Like I'm saying, the relegation match for us, it's the key. That's something that we're looking up uh, forward to.